Hey knitters, it's Monday and I'm pretty excited because I got new glasses. I bought the frames around Christmas time on Etsy. They're actually vintage, I know, so hipster of me. Um, but I couldn't get frames in them, or lenses in them until recently, so I just got them back and I'm super excited about it and I thought I would show them off in this video because I think they're really cool. I don't think anyone else really does, but that's okay because they're mine and I like them and I paid a lot of money for them. So, yay, new glasses! Meira, I loved seeing around your house last week. Um, the British and English flags that you have hanging in your house are really cool. Um, your family is awesome. I'm a little bit jealous. And it was good to see Sharona and things like that. So, um, A plus video making. I'm glad you liked my idea of walking around your house. And it, it turned out really good for you. Kayla, congratulations on your new niece. Don't worry about not making a video because that's way, way more exciting. Um, than making a video. And I hope that everyone is doing well and that you're have, enjoying having a new niece around. That's super exciting. Um, I actually did a little bit of crocheting this week. Um, I'm getting closer to having this done. I started working on the scalloped edge last night um, and I just have um, a couple more sides to go and that'll be done. And I will have knit a, or crocheted, I guess, a baby blanket, um, my first blanket ever which is an accomplishment, kind of, because I didn't make most of this, but I finished it, so it counts, right? So the theme this week, I actually thought about it a little bit, um, is going to be summer reading. I want to know what you have been reading and what you hope to finish reading before the end of the summer, um, because that's what you're supposed to do in the summer, right? You're supposed to read a bunch. I'm terrible at reading during the summer. I don't know why, if it's just because I read all year long, like read my little eyes out, and then I just can't by the time summer gets around. I have to do other things. That could be it. I'm not sure. Um, so I haven't done much reading this summer, but I did read the first um, A Song of Ice and Fire book, which is Game of Thrones, um, because I wanted to start watching the show. I've talked a little bit about this already, but um, I really liked the first book. Um, it's kind of scary, and but it's kind of like it's got intrigue, you know, it's the Game of Thrones, and um, the characters are all really interesting. Most of them aren't that likable, um, but I got really attached to the Starks already, which I know is a mistake, uh, because no one lives in George R. R. Martin books, but that's okay. Getting attached to characters that die is what that, like, that's what I do. So I'm just gonna let it happen and keep going. I'm not gonna be able to start reading the second book until I get some of the summer reading done I have for school, um, which I started. Um, the first thing I'm, go I'm reading for school is Howard's End by E.M. Forster. And I'm reading this so that I can read another book that I got assigned for school, which is Zadie Smith's On Beauty. And I've read um, White Teeth by Zadie Smith and I love it. It's one of my favorite books. Um, and I, I talked a little bit about it because I read it for school at um, my home school and I also read it for school when I was in Ireland and that was a great experience and I just think it's funny and amazing and I hope On Beauty is just as good but I guess On Beauty is kind of a retelling of Howard's End so I'm excited to see what that's like because I'm not sure what to expect. Um, but yeah, I have to read that for one of my classes that I'll be starting next semester, and that's exciting. Those are my main plans for the rest of the summer. Um, I also really want to read the new J.K. Rowling book. Who saw that one coming? Not me. I, I, oh, I'm so mad at myself because I heard about it the night before, but I didn't immediately go out and buy a copy. So I screwed that up big deal, and I'm probably going to get the crappy reprint one, and I'm a little upset about it, but... What are you going to do? I'll get to read it eventually. And it's exciting. Yay, new J.K. Rowling. And that's pretty much all I have to say. I hope everyone's having, or going to have a great week. And I will see Amber and Kayla later in the week. Bye!